I'd like to take a few minutes to talk about just how ridiculously fast the speed of light really is. Now we know that light itself is an oscillating magnetic field and an oscillating electric field propagating through space with no medium. It comes in chunks or packets of energy called photons. And the speed of light is always the same number no matter how fast you are moving or no matter how fast the source of the light is moving. In numbers, the speed of light is about 186,000 miles per second. That's a second, that's a second, that's a second. I'm even going a little too fast. 186,000, 186,000, and so on. That's about seven times all the way around the planet Earth every single second. In terms of meters, that's about 300 million meters every single second, which is about 300,000 kilometers per second. And that means that a photon can travel from the Earth all the way to the moon in about 1.3 seconds. Now the Earth is about 93 million miles away from the sun, but even at that distance, it takes light about eight minutes to travel from the sun to the Earth. And that means that if the sun somehow just disappeared right now, we wouldn't even know about it for about eight minutes. Now think about how fast light is, seven times around the Earth in one second, but yet it still takes light about eight minutes to get to the sun. That tells you two things. Light is really ridiculously fast, and the universe and everything in it is ridiculously spaced out far apart. At the other end of the solar system, we have Neptune here, which is about four and a half billion kilometers away, and it takes light about four hours to travel all the way out to Neptune. Here's another picture with the sun at the center. The heliopause is the boundary of the solar wind, and it would take light about 17 hours to reach the edge. But that's not where the solar system stops. After that, we have the Kuiper Belt and then the Oort Cloud. It would take light about two years to reach the edge of the Oort Cloud. Here's a cartoon of the Milky Way with two satellite galaxies that we have. The Milky Way is about 100,000 light years across. It would take light about 100,000 years to cross our galaxy. The Milky Way is a couple of satellite galaxies that you can see right here, which are about 200,000 light years away and the Andromeda galaxy is about two and a half million light years away. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.